Hi guys, my name is Shurujit De and you are watching my YouTube channel Econometrix De. Today we are going to solve class 6 mathematics. So without wasting further time, let's start the class. This could be us. So back to what I was saying. <laughs> So students, this is the second part of this chapter for class 6, class 6 mathematics and the name of the chapter is chapter 15, perimeter and area and we are solving exercise 15.1 and today we are going to solve question number 1D and the figure is given here. Okay, you can refer to your textbook, the same figure is in your textbook, so this is the figure, okay. Now, you, if you see nicely in this figure, then you can notice here the figure has been named A, D, E, F, I, J, okay, but all the names are not given, like if this is A then this one will be this point the name is not given so we will write b then here c then d then e then f then g then h and then i then j now the diagram is complete okay now we are going to find out the perimeter of this diagram okay of this figure so let's start so first of all we will write the information so what is given a b so here a b is how much a b one centimeter clear now next what is given after a b b c b c how much b c six centimeter see here b c after that, let me give comma, after uh, or you can write below below also, okay. So, A B 1 centimeter, B C 6 centimeter, C D, C D, C D is how much? 1 centimeter. Then after that, next information is what? D E, D E is what? 4 centimeter. After that, E F. E F is also 4 centimeter. Okay. Then F G. F G. How much? 1 centimeter. Then G H. G H is how much? 6 centimeter. Then after that H I. H I is how much? 1 centimeter. Then after that H I i j i j i j is how much 4 centimeter and then j a j a how much 4 centimeter so all the informations we have now written okay see here how many sides are here 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10. So, here also let us see 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So, 10 informations we have written. Now, we will find out the perimeter. So, what we will write if I do it here, therefore, perimeter, perimeter of this figure okay perimeter of what is the name of the figure a b c d e f g h i j equal to now these all the sides i will now add it up okay so i will write a b plus b c plus c d plus d e plus E F plus F G plus G H plus H I 
प्लस आई जे प्लस जे ए वी स्टार्टेड फ्रॉम ए वी हैव एंडेड एट ए ओनली क्लियर नाउ वी विल पुट द वैल्यूज सो हाउ वी विल पुट द वैल्यूज लेट सी फर्स्ट वन ए बी वन सेंटीमीटर बी सी सिक्स सी डी वन डी ई फोर ई एफ फोर एफ जी वन जी एच सिक्स एच आई वन आई जे फोर जे ए फोर क्लियर नाउ वी विल पुट अ ब्रैकेट एंड देन वी विल राइट सेंटीमीटर क्लियर नाउ वी विल एडिट सो वन प्लस सिक्स सेवन सेवन प्लस वन एट एट प्लस फोर ट्वेल्व ट्वेल्व प्लस फोर सिक्सटीन सिक्सटीन प्लस वन सेवनटीन सेवनटीन प्लस सिक्स ट्वेंटी थ्री प्लस वन ट्वेंटी फोर ट्वेंटी एट थर्टी टू सो वी गॉट द आंसर थर्टी टू सेंटीमीटर ओके नाउ वी विल मूव टू द नेक्स्ट सम नाउ इन क्वेश्चन नंबर वन E. Let's see. This is the diagram. Okay. If I divide it, okay, we will do here question number one E and here F. Okay. Now in one E, we can see a triangle. Okay, and all the three sides are different. So if in a triangle three sides are different, what it is known as? It is a scaling triangle. Okay. So let us write the information first. P S equal to eleven centimeter, comma S R S R equal to twelve centimeter, and then R P R P equal to thirteen centimeter. Clear. Now after that, I will write the perimeter. Therefore, perimeter of i can write here triangle also perimeter of triangle p s r then what i will write p s plus s r plus r p okay if i write perimeter of figure p s r that is also correct okay not wrong now after this what i will write i will put the values 11 cm plus 12 cm Plus thirteen centimeter, and then we will add it, and we will get the answer. So for adding, so big big numbers are here. You can do a rough. So what you will do, you will write eleven plus twelve, so twenty three. One plus two three, or one plus one two twenty three. After that, thirteen you are going to add, so six and three. So what you get, thirty six centimeter. Clear. i think up to this much now number f i will rub the rough work okay number f what it is telling this is the figure or the diagram okay and we will write the information first is ab how much 6 cm bc how much 8 cm cd how much 8 cm and the last one is ad ad is how much ad 6 cm so if you see nicely what you can see the shape the figure looks like a kite okay so now already in class 5 you have learnt about uh, different types of quadrilateral okay trapezium is there kite is there here this is kite okay but in this sum we will understand that it is a it is only a figure okay so now we will find out the perimeter perimeter of a b c d okay it is a quadrilateral four sides now what i will do i will add the sides a b plus b c plus c d plus D A. 
or AD. I have written AD upside, so I will write here AD only. Okay. If I wrote DA, then I will write DA. Okay. Now I will put the values 6 plus 8 plus again 8 plus 6 and then give a bracket and write sentiment. So different ways we can do sums. Like here I wrote centimeter, centimeter, centimeter. Here I am not writing. Here I am putting a bracket and outside I am writing centimeter. So what do you get? 6 plus 8, 14. Now 14 plus 8, okay, 22. And 22 plus 6, 28. Clear? You can add like this also 6 plus 8, 14. Again here 6 plus 8, 14. 14 plus 14, 28. So 28 centimeter. Okay. Understood? Now the next sum we will do that is question number 2 we will solve in our part 3. Okay. If you like my video then please give a like, share it with your friends and don't forget to subscribe it. And also press the all notification button so that whenever I upload such videos you will get the notifications first. And those who have not watched class 6 this chapter that is chapter 15 perimeter and area I have shared the link in the description below as well as the in the i button okay so thank you for watching my video keep smiling bye bye